Yo, 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 guys, this is uh, Timmons here, coming at you live from England. Um, hello. Today, we are back with more Timmons Does Some Supreme Cooking. Now, today is different. We are no longer cooking breakfasts and lunches. Today, we are cooking snack things, and we are cooking stuff called peanut butter cups. If you ever tried Reese's peanut butter cups, you all know what I'm on about. Uh, they're brilliant, and they're great, and what's that doing there? Um, okay, so first off, you just need a crap ton of like milk chocolate and white chocolate. So, yeah, that, that's just that. Just get that, and then just chop them all up, and uh, it should all be fine and dandy. It has been done. So yeah, just like singular pieces like this will do. But we just need to keep them separate. Separate. Do not mix them because that will just knacker everything up. So we're gonna get this chocolate. Ball. Yeah, I did a taste. I did the taster, a tester before I started filming this because you know, just make sure it all works. And it does work because I'm an absolute pro. Um, you don't need to weigh anything. When do I ever weigh anything? Never. If you look at my other videos. Just bung it all in, it'll all be right somehow. If you need any more of anything else, then you bug it, but okay. So what we're going to do with this, oh, I'm going to take the spoon out. Oh, get off, thanks. Uh, and I'm going to stick this in the microwave for about like 30 seconds to a minute at a time. And then... Um, Every 30 seconds or minute, we are going to give it a good old stir, and um, that will just stop it from burning. So, whilst we wait, we can practice our dance moves. We can do many things, but uh, in my case, I like to stick on the radio and sing along to emotional songs. So... I'm going to go do that, and I'll be back soon. Okay, so I've had a good sing-along now, and uh, eventually this has all been, uh, been melted in ye old microwave. So what we're going to do is, this is going to be the bottom, bottom uh, of here, and also the top of here, the middle, will be uh, white chocolate mixed with peanut butter. But for now, we're just going to... Uh, to spoon in this bad boy into here. Uh, we, we need this bottom layer pretty thick, otherwise it like uh, falls through a little bit when you're eating them, and that's not very good. So I'll just label label this out a little bit, um, and just a little bit more, and it'll all be sorted. Come on. There you go. Lovely stuff, okay. So, um, what you're gonna do now with this, I'm only gonna do uh, this one. I'll just do this one to show you. What we're gonna do with this is we're gonna go stick this in the freezer. I allocated a, uh, a little like shelf for you. There was a chicken on here. There's none anymore. It's with the, uh, with the ice cream, so. Uh, where it should be. So that won't take long, won't take long at all, maybe like a minute, I don't know. But um, yeah, in that time I'll just get along doing some more. Alrighty, so uh, after a while I've just added a few more uh, to the batch and we can see now that our original one is uh, is shaping up pretty well. I like guess it's, it's not dripping or anything. So what we're going to start now is we are going to start uh, with the white chocolate. Um, now the white chocolate is a little bit different to the uh, to the milk chocolate. As soon as though we actually add uh, peanut butter to this one, um, no, this is like the peanut butter filling thing on a Reese's peanut butter cup. So you got that there, and I'll just use this spoon. Um, hang on. That was very quick opening, I just managed to open it with my eyes. 
And I was just we're just gonna add like a few dumps into there. Not 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 too much, because like otherwise it won't freeze. It'll be like really, really liquidy. So yeah, just give me a second and I will pot this in. Alright, sorted, lovely. Um so now this time uh gonna stick in here. Well, just the same. But uh what will happen is this will melt and so will the peanut butter and we'll just be able to uh, mix it all in like last time. But well that that was bad. That wasn't nearly as bad as I was hoping for. Um okay, so yeah, once that waits I'll go practice my dance routine. So uh yeah, I shall see you soon. Okay, so um this is what we ended up with. It's kind of like uh, like like milk chocolate but it's a little bit more orange. That's because of the peanut butter. But don't worry about that. That's all good. So these are all doing pretty good, but this is our original one. So let's go do it. It's like a story. Um we have to uh we have to stick with the original one. See? Hard, that's what we want. Um let's get this over here. Alright, so we want this layer to be pretty thick, seeing as like this is the main taste layer, I guess. This is the one that your taste buds will be most excited about, I guess. Um Oh no, the twizzle the twizzle never works. Um Timmons' top tips. Alliteration, I like it. Uh twizzle never works. Um Alright. And let's get another scoop on this bad boy. And in we go. Let's just smooth that out a little bit. Alright, now this layer will take a little bit longer because of the, um, you know, it, it's got peanut butter in it. So it's not going to uh, to freeze as quick. But it, it, it'll, it'll be alright. Uh, I'll just stick that. Just, I'll stick that one in the front. I should have stuck that one in the front in the first place. Um, I'll do the others in a moment. I shall uh, be back with you soon when um, when that one's done. That one. Uh, the suspense must be killing you right now. I am very sorry to hear that, but uh, all shall be revealed. Alright, guys. So um, after this has been in the freezer for a good couple of minutes or something, this is the most important layer. So you want that to be in the freezer for, for quite a while. Um, yeah, so now we've got this, we're going to add the top layer, but I made a little bit of a cock up. Um, we needed this mixture to uh, actually go on the top as well, but I actually made all of them the bottom bases, so um, I had to salvage two of the bottom bases to make more of this mixture. So I would like to spend this time to pay tribute to the fallen that have sacrificed themselves to be part of this mixture, or as my English teacher would say, I severed a finger to save the hand. Alright guys, so this is the final step. Uh, we're going to use this mixture now that we got here. And we're just going to add this. Hang on a second, once this stream is stopped. We're going to add this to the top of here. Now this doesn't have to be too thick. Uh, it's just going to be enough for like uh, so, so that you can actually hold it with your hand and not actually it fall through, which is uh, not not too thick as long as you get the middle layer good old uh, good old frozen then uh, then you should be right. Uh, let's just get this a good old uh, spread about and we should be sorted and. There we go, that's all good. Um, and lastly, what we do now is we just stick it in the freezer. And open that up. And there we have it. And I will just show you the finished product once this has stopped freezing. Okay, so we're going to see the final product. And here we have it. We have the bad boy. So, I am going to crack this one open, and I shall show you it once it's open. Very nice thin layer there, that is very good. Um, okay, so this is what we wanted. Uh, I've only been able to make four, including 
that one and my test one because I had to salvage those other two. It's deep in my heart. Very deep. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed this, guys. I shall be back with some more cooking very shortly. I will not be waiting. I will be right there. I will not keep you waiting. Good day, my fellow sirs and sirvesses.